So I read God No by Penn Jillette, or rather listened to it as an audiobook version read by him, and it was a decent book. I liked it. Not my best book, in the, not my most favorite book in the world, but it's a book that I enjoyed. And really, it, it's not that hard to find out if you like this kind of book or not. I thought it was a book more on atheism, but actually it was it's kind of like a biography of Penn Jillette. He's just talking about his life. Of course, he talks about a lot of atheist stuff, but about his childhood, about his friends, about some of his religious friends, his non-religious friends, um, and various stories. So... Um, if you haven't, if you don't know anything about Penn Jillette, first just start listening to some, to some stuff by Penn Jillette. He does have a podcast called Penn Sunday School, and like I said, I listened to the audiobook version of this book, and it sounded very similar. Like it felt like an episode of Penn Sunday School that was a bit more fleshed out, obviously a bit more edited, and less like off the cuff. Uh, so if you enjoy, like, listen to Penn Penn Sunday School podcast. If you enjoy his podcast, then you will enjoy this book. The podcast is free, so it's a nice way of finding. Like this is just a supplement i guess this is a supplement to his um book he's also got a show call he did have a show on youtube called pen point both of those i'll try to remember to leave in the description same kind of thing although the, like it's just him rambling but it's a bit more fleshed out because it's it's an actual published book um, but it's the same kind of thing so if you will enjoy if you enjoy his podcast if you enjoy listening to him ramble about stuff for free on the internet then you'll enjoy the book i mean it's it's not too preachy like pen's one of those few people where I mean, if you're a religious person, if you're going to read a single, like, atheist book out there, this is one This is one that you would read. Because Penn Jillette is, um, I mean, if you're easily offended, if you're the, like, easily offended type, he is, this is a very raunchy book. Um, because Penn is a very, like, raunchy person a lot of the time. Uh, but generally, like, yeah, if you're ever going to read a book from the perspective of an atheist talking about atheism, this is a book to read. It's not preachy. It's just Penn talking about stuff. And talking about what he thinks, and he's, like, He's, he's not very, he's not ideological about it. He's not like, I'm right and you're wrong. He's just like, hey, this is what I believe and this is why. <laughs> and then here's also 28 other stories. Um, but no, I very much enjoyed it. Um, again, like, not the best book in the world, but I do like Penn. And it was, um, it was a decent book. So if you have read it, let me know what you think in the comments section. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more. And thanks for watching.